dear students now we are going to see relationship between kp and kc okay so let us consider as usual reversible reaction a moles of a b moles of b react with each other to produce c moles of c and d moles of d okay so already we knew the chemical equilibrium constant in terms of concentration is given by this value we already derived this this value okay so now here we took this value okay this is equation number 2 kc is equal to concentration of c power c and then d moles of d and a moles of a and b moles of b okay so next the equilibrium constant in terms of partial pressure is given by we knew already this equation also okay we took kp and kc values okay so after that from ideal gas equation we knew what pv is equal to nrt so this d will come this side means at the time p is equal to n divided by v into rt okay so now this n divided by v is equal to so n means what number of moles okay v means volume in liter okay so number of moles divided by volume in liter is generally known as concentration so that is uh, that that's what sorry that's what so now we are going to consider this n by v is equal to c okay so this above equation 5 becomes p is equal to c concentration into rt okay this is equation number 6 after that now we got p value partial pressure value okay c into rt so now we are going to substitute these all reactant and then product partial pressure values so for example p a a moles of p a is equal to concentration of a moles of a and into rt power a a means number of moles okay so next pb value next is pc value finally we will write pd value like this okay next now we got all these partial pressure values after this partial pressure values we will substitute these all values in equation 3 okay in this kp value so that is kp is equal to c moles of c into rt so instead of this pc value now we will put this value okay so the uh, um, we will add remaining uh, p b value pc value and also p a value okay here so we substituted this all values after that we will write this equation we will just rearrange this equation like this okay so the concentration will uh, comes this side and then rt values we will write this rt values in this side okay so now we knew okay this value what what is this overall this uh, this is actually kc value this kc value okay concentration of c concentration of d divided by concentration of a and concentration of b value is kc okay so that's what here we are going to put kc here okay so again here rt no so um, in power uh, c moles of c and d moles of d is there no so how will we write this power values rt is equal to c plus d so it's a plus b in divide state it will go up means at the time rt is equal to c plus d minus a plus b okay so this uh, c plus d minus a plus b is equal to del n okay so that's what we will add this del n value here okay so the finally this kp value is equal to 
this is kc okay this is kc into rt power del n okay then box this equation this is equation number 9 okay so this is the relationship between kp and kc so if we are writing this the relationship between kp and kc means at the time we will consider what ideal gas equation pv is equal to nrt from this equation we derived this relationship okay so now this question is over next relationship between kp and kx okay here also consider the reversible reaction already we derived kx value okay already we derived kx value we got this value after that again we consider kp value okay so after that in this relationship we are going to uh, take raoult's law what is raoult's law partial pressure of a gas is equal to mole fraction into total pressure this is known as raoult's law we knew what is partial pressure of a gas p is equal to mole fraction symbol x into total pressure is this capital p this is equation number 4 okay here we are going to write this partial pressure value like this for example pa is equal to x a here we have x value no so a is the reactant so that's what x a into p okay next we will write the remaining value like this next substitute these all values in equation 3 this equation kp value okay so here we substituted this value so what's this um, pc power c value is this pc value is xc into p okay concentration of xc into p power what how many moles c moles that's what we wrote xc into p power c okay then again we are adding these all remaining values in this equation 3 okay and finally we will get this kp value this is equation number 5 after that this kp value is equal to here also we are going to write like this okay so mole fraction values ella one side konnu vandittu partial pressure value ella sorry total pressure value ella one side konnu vittu porom okay va so konnu poi elna eppadi kedaikum kp is equal to this whole value is kx value this is equal to kx we knew already it is equation number 1 already we gave here here no so this whole value is equal to kx that's what we are going to write here this is kx into p power we knew already how will we write this power c plus d minus here a plus b this a plus b divided la iruka a plus b mele pochina minus okay so finally we knew already c plus d minus a plus b is equal to del n okay so that's what this equation becomes kp is equal to kx into p power del n okay this is the relationship between kp and kx okay va so do not forget this for the relationship between kp and kx we are going to, we are we consider raoult's law okay the relationship between kp and kc we considered what ideal gas equation pv is equal to nrt okay do not forget this two points okay this is very 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 important and also these two questions are very easiest questions if you have any doubt means you may ask okay thank you students